With the mustache of champions, the California Dreamin' mustache. Wait, who? Noah, have you seen his mustache? It's like, it's like I'm Hispanic and I'm proud, and it's great. <laughs> I love it. It's better, it's better than a lot of ones I've seen. I'll be real. It's a great He's, mustache. Yeah. <laughs> you got a good mustache. Yeah, but this is like, I might work at a pizza shop. Dude, Weasel One has a good mustache. He does. This is it's I, a full goatee. We are, are we, not children here. Yeah, we grow facial hair. Many men are present. <laughs> so now we got a. Uh, so no one game one. Uh, we got Bro, some. Let me update that. I think I... Wait, Noah won. For yeah, sure? Noah game one game one. I'm assuming he. They are not switch characters, which would be pretty BM if they were. And then this matchup so fascinating to me because. It it I don't it'd be like if we fought an alien race that didn't even like experience us on the same plane, you know? Like it's like everything's different. Same Yoshi, some sort of alien character. Yeah. yeah, it's like it's hard to even experience Yoshi in the neutral sometimes. It's like what's even going on? I, this guy's just like whirling around me with these crazy movement things. He doesn't jump out of shield. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he like and if they're good they parry. Yeah. Like, what? Like Yeah, I can't attack their shield. Wait, approaching even, is there's wrong. no safe. Yeah. <laughs> He's a bad character and I can't approach. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> What's going on? It doesn't make sense. But it does. It does. I mean, once you figure it out, Yoshi's like pretty easy to beat. Once you realize, especially as Fox, that, that Yoshi has to approach you in, the, in a shitty way eventually, yes. you can kind of just stand there and up tilt. Exactly. <laughs> Have you watched the Japanese foxes like uh, fight Amza? No. You're like, oh, how did that fox beat Amza? Like, Amza beat has taken games off Mango, and you watch him. It's like, oh, they just, they don't give him any shit. They're yeah. just like running away, up tilt, down there, wave shine, up smash, next the talk. The threshold of like outplaying that you have to meet for like Fox versus Yoshi is very low compared to most other matchups. Yeah. But... Oh, shit. Oh, God. See, like there, if Yoshi could jump out of shield, that would have been such a good situation. Instead, he had to sit there and hope he went down and hit him. 
You know what does that a lot? <laughs> what, the nair? Specifically, he'll nair, and like you think you avoid it, and then he'll just do another really unsafe double jump nair, like extend. Yeah. It's like Michael Jordan in Space Jam, when he like <laughs> does the final dunk and his arm stretches all the way across the ring. Are you saying that that was an unnecessary move for him to make? <laughs> no, I'm saying that he overextended his arm very far. But it was the right move to make in that yeah, moment. So you're correct. No, where's the yeah, metaphor here? Same thing. Noah, it's the right move to make in the moment because it hits me. Oh, okay. Often. I thought you're saying it doesn't hit. But it looks ridiculous while he does it. It's it like, dude, you just like did that whole weird running jump thing at me and pulled out an air, and I still <laughs> didn't avoid it. When it happens and you get hit by it, you're like, all right, you know what you're doing. All right, Michael Jordan, I get it. You can stretch your arm really far, all right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Next time, I'm going to block that shot. <laughs> Did you ever play the Space Jam? Like, I think it was PS1 game. No. Oh, it's like Super the Jam. I didn't have a PS1. I was one of those kids that just had the GameCube, just had the N64, like half the Melee community. I was one of those just Nintendo nerds that think they're better than everyone because I like <laughs> Nintendo games. But I, then I secretly went to my friend's house and played their PlayStation. It was sick. Nice. <laughs> but how was the Space Jam game? Tell me a it defining feature. Sad. What's weird about it is that the Tasmanian Devil, I think that, that's what it's called, right? The Tasmanian Devil, he also has the stretchy arm trick, which doesn't really make sense. Not, dude, that's like against the lore. Yeah, the Space Jam. They like totally gave up in the, in the making of that character. <laughs> just like, yeah, just give him Michael Jordan's special yeah. move. <laughs> that's fine. So you can play as Michael Jordan. Can you play as the bad guys? Yeah. Like definitely. the? Did they stop the fake? Like what, what are their names? I forget. Did they have the names of the? Because they took the powers of like Charles Barkley. Oh and, yeah. Like, remember that? Yeah. And, like all these famous, like really famous basketball greats. <laughs> they like came and like kidnapped them and sucked them dry or whatever. Power. Like, what, what did they even take from him? Was like their talent, like it was a glowy magic, their basketball yeah. talent. Somehow they got the, the basketball to hold that. Oh, and it was like a uh, Noah wins. It also was general athleticism too. I, but it was basketball talent and general athleticism because they got buff. 